In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up this incubator, but also a lot of other incubators made in China. If you haven't subscribed to this channel, make sure to subscribe and not miss any of our egg incubator videos. So let's get started. First of all, you have to make sure to match the right temperature for incubating eggs. If we consider incubating chickens, then we need for the first 19 days a temperature of 37.8 degrees. And in the last two days, we need to lower the temperature to 37.5 degrees. This is really important to get a good hatching rate. To set up the temperature to the value that you want to have, so for example 37.8 degrees, you need to press the set button just once. And now you can adjust the temperature by pressing the plus and min button and then press set again. To check the temperature again, you have to press the set button. So you see the temperature is set correctly. So when you set up the temperature right, there are also alarms you can set up. There's one for too high temperature, one for too low temperatures, and there's also an alarm for the humidity. So let's jump in and do that. So now let's get into to the menu and set a alarm for too low or too high temperatures. For that we need to hold the set button for three seconds and now you see the alarm for low temperatures. Press the set button again and now we can set it to for example one degree. So the alarm is ringing if the temperature gets one degree below 37.8. And now we can do the same thing for two high temperatures and that would be AH. Press the set button again and now we can adjust it by pressing the min to one degree. And now let's set the alarm for the humidity to 50%. We have to hold the set button for three seconds and then we need to go to HS. This is that one. Press the set button again and now we can put this up to whatever we like. For example, 50%. Here we go. Press the set button again and now we set the alarm to 50%. That means if the humidity drops below 50, it's going to set the alarm. As you can see, we just reached 43 person and it's blinking but because i just adjust everything it's not giving the alarm but if it gets above the 50 ones and then below then it's going to set the alarm and it's uh, making an awful noise so now you know how to set up the temperature the humidity alarm and the temperature alarms but there's also a really important thing that you should know. What you see here are all really cheap incubators from China. And the one big problem with all of these incubators is that they are not accurate at all. And that is a big issue when it comes to incubating eggs. Because precision is so important to get a good hatching rate. So if you have one of these really cheap incubators and you're wondering why your hatching rate is much too low, then this is not a wonder at all. I know so many people contacting me and asking for what they are doing wrong. And in my opinion, those are all not really good for incubating eggs. So if you have any experience about one of these incubators, then put your experience in the comments below and let other people know what you experienced. And if you are looking for a really high quality incubator with really high hatching rates, check the video description. I will put some links in with high quality incubators so you know what to buy and what not to buy. I hope you really learned something out of this video and if you did, give your thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, stay tuned for the next videos. Thanks for watching, have a nice day.